thank you Vivor for partnering with me for today's video. Vivor is an online company that has many, many products that are suitable for commercial or home use. They have, their slogan is tough tools, half the price, which is very true. You can go onto their website and find a ton of great quality products. We have multiple things from Vivor over the years and they are just good quality things. So how great this is gonna be for my kids. They love slushies. You know they love slushies. I decided to put this outside today. It's not gonna work if it's really hot outside to be able to, you know, cause the temperature's gonna be too warm. It's gonna make it too hard to cool, but you just fill it up with any kind of sugary based solution. You know, you could do like a uh, blue raspberry, you know, cherry, whatever you want, but we're gonna use Coke because <laughs> just pour it in and let it slush it up, which is awesome. I'm thinking like apple cider slushies, same concept, how delicious that would be. So I'm just gonna pour three of these in. You gotta make sure it goes to the water line on here and then turn it on, let it slush, and we're gonna have slushies at home today. And what's great is you can do it it gives cold drinks we're gonna do slush slushy maker has been cooling doing its thing it's good because you can do it at different temperatures if you just want to do like a cold drink and just put like lemonade in there i mean i would slush the lemonade but you don't have to and you can just keep it cold and it'll just keep it going in there to be able to drink from so how awesome so i'm leaving this out today my kids are just going to be able to go up and get slushies all day i mean it seems like a lot but in reality when you have so many kids it really doesn't The great thing is you can go up or down depending on what kind of consistent you want. So you could put like coffee drinks in here, like how great to have a party and do coffee drinks, like iced coffee drinks, but like the slushy frappuccino kind, that would be awesome. Lemonade, like I said, the sugar content just has to be a certain percentage and it tells you inside the book. Awesome, my kids are gonna have Coke slushies. Okay, I've got my first customer, Maddie. She's the queen of loving slushies. So how do you mm. think you got one right here? Go ahead and get your cup. So, get a cup. Get okay. a cup. Ooh. It's a little bit thicker, so we can do different temperatures. It'll be good. Yeah, it's depending on what kind we like. So, but that's gonna be so good. What do you think, slushies? Slushy Slushies. approved. All right. It approved. tastes like a normal slushie. Tastes like a normal slushie, which is awesome. Highly so. recommend. <laughs> <laughs> Highly recommend. Okay, so now it's the end of the day. Slushies have been out all day. Kids, Kids have been, been using it all day long. Drinking it. So now, because now it's gonna go below that water level. So now it's got to be full past it to do the slushy thing. Uh -huh. Otherwise, half it is having us. But you still get like yeah. just cold drink. Well, it's all iced up right now. Right. Now you can just have a cold drink. Can I try? You can. Thank you. It's literally just Coke. So you get like a little slush in there too. But you can just have it be just like a cold drink oh my goodness, that's as well. So what do we got with the control panel? So you put on a cold drink and it it automatically sets a threshold for you. For cold drink on the side it says CD. So you have basically two codes that'll pop up in your window. One is CD1 for cold drink one and slushy is SL1. So the uh, factory setting is minus two degrees Celsius for the slushy temperature. And then for the cold drink, it's uh, five degrees Celsius. So for the cold drink, you're you know, just above that zero, that zero mark. Yeah, so if you're on cold drink, you know, and you try to subtract, it's like, it, it'll only let you go down to a certain, you know, a certain threshold. Right. See, like we're on slushy now, SL1, see how it just switched okay, over? Okay, that's the tip. Yeah, so now I can take that, you know, all the way down to minus five, and that'll start, that'll start whipping out those slushies. So, um, you know, get it over to, let's see, let's see if it'll automatically switch over to cold drink. Okay, so it's on, it's on slushy one, so it won't let you go any above zero because it knows it won't make slushy. So let's see how do we get it over to the cold drink side. There is CD1, see? So you, it, it like, it, it won't let you, it's kind of foolproof, you know? It's just like, as long as you understand the temperature range that you gotta be in, you know, then you can go above above zero for your cold drink. And you can make it, you know, pretty cold. You're gonna get real close to zero. Right. You know, so it's gonna, it's gonna form ice in there. It's gonna be a little, a little bit slushy, but this thing is awesome. It's like an industrial type machine, you know? leave it out all day for yeah. you just come get drinks yep and depending on what you want to make you know the digital control panel bam switches for you and it's got lighting i probably can't tell very much but oh it's got a little red <laughs> led in there which is cool at night when right. you got a little party little house outside. party going on or whatever pool party so it's its own contained unit it's got its own ac coils condenser coils and stuff and it's got its own little drip yeah have it all when you're drip done. nozzle right here so it pulls the moisture and drops it for you in a, a little container which is very cool so you don't have 
condensation built all up over all it. over your table and whatnot. So. And then to clean it, when you shut it off, you just make sure this is empty, obviously, yeah. and then just take it off. And all this is a drip pan as well. That's yeah. all drain right down and this, here. And this, it, just just as a note, this is almost a two-person job to get this on. Yes. Because it's got a it's got a big round rubber seal around the back, and it's a it's a, a multi lip seal, so it's a really good seal off. So make sure it goes behind. The and it's lip a tension right fit on the on the lip, so you really got to give it a shove kind of on either side, and then snap that down, and it really snaps in. You can almost lift the machine up with how tight it snaps in there, which is really cool. Yeah. So if you're you know if you're if you're the type of family that likes to have get-togethers or card nights and you got you know a, a large group of kids everybody's getting together and playing and you know the adults want to have some time together to, to talk and do whatever you know and you need you need stuff for the kids to do excellent excellent, excellent alternative thing, yes. yeah. so they also have like a ton of other industrial things like they have popcorn machines they have the shaved ice we have the shaved ice oh, from yeah. them mm -hmm. they have just a ton of cotton candy machine they have a lot of industrial commercialized equipment yeah. so if you guys want to get one i will link this one below and they'll give you a coupon code or check out their website there's a ton of automotive i went through it already there's a ton on there so Very thank cool. you v4 for partnering with us in today's video thank you excellent product Day today. Uh, we're I was going to say okay, that. You got it. Ready? We'll start again. Okay. You ready? No. Uh, you got it. Yeah. You got to keep this part in though. <laughs> hey guys. Hope you're having a great day. <laughs> today is. I don't know what today rainy. is. Rainy. It's rainy. It's rainy, and we are at. Well, kind of our favorite store, but not really our favorite store. <laughs> Uh, my favorite store. Me and the boys. How about that? <laughs> well, I was just thinking. And sometimes noodle time. All the other trips we had to make here. We are at Lowe's actually right now. I was going to say not Home Depot because uh -huh. that was our favorite store forever. Yeah. Now it, I like Home Depot because it's more commercialized. Right. And a lot of times they're more in stock where Lowe's is kind of more residential type people that are doing gardening projects and like smaller things. Yeah, like we've got that. projects. We We're back. Always got projects. They don't even know what's going on, but uh -uh. it's been a good weekend. I think last weekend I started packing and they knew all that. So it is official. We're moving. We're moving. Congratulations. Congratulations. And it wasn't you. that we were trying to hide it from you guys. We just didn't know and nothing was uh -huh. set in stone. So now it takes a, it takes a little bit for, you know, is your job gonna work out? And, is you know, the like due a, diligent good? Is the inspection passing? Yeah. Can you sign the contract? Is mm -hmm. it good? We had to wait till all of that went through and we had a long time for ours. And so now we can say it's official. It's official. So we're moving. And it's the we'll just say the weather is a little different. <laughs> <laughs> we can share where it doesn't really matter. I mean, it's not like a secret. Oh, oh my gosh. Well, I'll just say it. By the time I got to Georgia, it was getting cold. It's cold. I can feel it. It's warm, yeah. so. Yeah, so we will be moving to the state of Florida. Florida. We're heading to the palm trees and the beach. It's going to be great. Yeah, so. we're going to be on the Gulf of Mexico. We're going to be on the Gulf side. <sighs> the hot weather, guys. Yeah. And we have a pool. We have an in-ground pool. Mm -hmm. That was like my dream. Yeah. Was the pool. <laughs> yeah. And this, that dream goes back. A long time ago. 20 years. That's what we got the Probably. The, yeah, we got the Intex pool and it was okay. I mean, it's, it worked what mm -hmm. we had, but I'm like, oh, we need a big Well, we've been doing pools for a long time. Yeah, we just wanted like the underground pool. Yeah, a nice like pool. Uh, our first state roadhouse. Right, yes. had a had our we had our first pool. Yeah, and I grew up with the pool, and Amy's neighbor had an in-ground pool. They had a huge, so oh you knew huge, what, like oh that yeah. was all about, and Wonderful. how nice that was to be fenced in and growing up around it. So, right. so that's always one. kind of been your thing is having. Well, one was uh, the beach and the ocean. I love the beach and the ocean, and yeah. I, I I can't say I've ever I've been there like one time. Yeah, as a teen, but didn't like I was like fifteen, and mm -hmm. then. We did go to Florida when we were like 12 for the yep, old yep. Disney World trip like yeah, everybody, everybody else. Does. But I don't really, like I've never actually been there. You so. don't remember the yeah. ocean. So I would think I would love it. I just have not. Well, you know you love it because. I love sunshine. I yeah. love like Joe Cassie. When it's intense heat. Love and, the intense heat. Yeah. Love, I, just, I love the mountains all the time. I just love that crystal clue of water. So that's where we're going. Yep. So. Yeah. And I ran through the, I, w I was there through uh, the last hurricane, mm -hmm. you know, and uh, got to see kind of like what that whole hurricane season is like. He's he has been there for his job. Mm -hmm. So we did the shop thing. It yeah, you great. gotta do the three months for before you even get your insurance. Yeah. All that kind of good stuff. And we're not moving your business. So I, and, and when you go to an area that you're completely unfamiliar with, you're lost. You have no idea 
you know, do I want to live in this town? Do I want to go right. here? Do I want to do this? So it's just been like a lot of exploring and, mm -hmm. you know, like what church is going to be suitable, right. you know, like we're for our whole it's family a, and where everybody's deal. going to get, yeah, it's like a big thing. So that's a big deal. It's, it took, it took probably four, five months just to figure out what you want to scope that whole place out mm -hmm. and figure out, you know, like, okay, this looks like right. we'll, you know, we would be very suited here mm -hmm. and you are you are an engineer so that's what you do uh, uh plastic injection mold designer, designer. 3d guy cnc programmer it's all engineer to me so we yeah. that's where he, he's doing we had the shop here and that was good mm -hmm. it's just a lot and i was watching another youtuber where her husband he did his own business and he like he said it's a lot of work and it is oh yeah because you're working all those hours because mm -hmm. you work for yourself which is awesome but you also have to put in all the paperwork hours oh yeah so meanwhile that's like a lot of hours away from your family oh yeah for sure and when you're 50 yeah. It's a lot of time yeah. gone. Well, like my whole reason for wanting to do it and to begin with was I always kind of had this dream like we'd have this family business and everybody would gravitate to it right. and we would just, you know, all the boys would want to work there and the girls could work in the office and right. this and that and the other thing. But in reality. And that's just not reality. Like their dreams are not the same, same as, as our mine. dreams. Right. And that's, that's good. That's normal. Yeah. That's what so kids like do. my passion, it, you know. Right. So it's, it's like, good. Yeah. You're, and then you're, and then you're like, why? You know why? It's why have like, the stress? Why have that? If you can go make more money right. at a job that you're really good at, it's a whole lot easier. Sure. And boop, clock out at the end of the day, and you're mm -hmm. done at four. Versus, we got to work until nine, yeah. ten tonight. And being, a, and being a region where we can focus on family. Yeah, yeah. So that's that's where we're at for uh, mm -hmm. all that stuff. So it's good. So we're excited. So we are going to be moving. So we just had to wait for everything to go through. So now it's like it's through. Yeah. And like good. I mean, that, it'll be finalized. I think we close in another week or so. So that'll be done. But we're out today because we have to do more projects. Mm. But not all the cement. Not no, all the, no. Easy, fun things. Yeah. The person that buying our house is just, uh, um, I think I can say all that. She's like a single lady. So mm -hmm. it's just things that like I know if I was by myself and had to move into a house, it'd be repairs to fix. But yeah. not things that like I know our house we're buying there's mm -hmm. a few things that I'm, sure. I guess I'm like could we have requested to have that stuff done I guess we could yeah, but we I, absolutely could have but, but they're, it's just, it's they're so all little. small things yeah. that I'm like equipped to do exactly so we're know, gonna actually enjoy to do yeah so we thought well so we have a list of things to do and get done this uh today and which the next couple days mm -hmm. which we'll get done easy ones easy so we're gonna go ahead into Home Depot or not Home Depot Lowe's well, well We'll wind up at both. I'm sure we will. Sure we, will. <laughs> we got coffee. And, we got and donuts. <laughs> so we're now living, we're living large. We're living large. So we're going to go ahead and do that. It's going to be a great day today. You ready for fun? Let's do it. Let's do it. Um, Ooh, baby cement. You want some? Nope. I don't ever want to see another bag of cement for a long time. <laughs> okay. We need some scotch Bright and some bleach. We need some caulk. Perfect. Oh, sorry. Okay. I you think know, I like, packed the caulking gun, you know, because <laughs> I'm prepared. So Because we have to, we're moving in like two weeks. <laughs> Less than two weeks, babe. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. There it is. All right. Doing good, babe. Thank you. I'm going to get one off. Just need a roller truck. Need some paint right here. Some primer right here. You think one will do? Paint brushes. Okay, we have to get a ceiling fixture. Okay, I'm on a mission. Greg is going to go. He's got to do some electrical work. I'm going to go look for a doorbell. Like, we don't even use our doorbell, but we're going to... It's very barely working, but we just need a new button. So that's what I'm looking for. Doorbell switch like right here. This is what we need. I literally think this is it. Oh, wired cable. That's what we need. Also need some uh, smoke alarms. Let me go see if they got the wired ones somewhere. Pretty sure we need these right here. I think it's cheaper. We only need four, but it's eighty-five dollars. They only have three right here, so I don't know. Twenty-four sixty. Still more to buy it this way. Hmm. I guess we just have extra. I'm finding some things like Greg's thinking through a project. Light switch play. I need three of these. I got a contractor pack for three. Look at me, I just I just found what he needed. Where, was it, was it, it was hidden. It, it was hidden it in the back and I searched. <laughs> we were having issues. They were saying that They're the so circuit fun. outlets, which we never replaced because they were with the house, were a different brand. Yeah, the color hammer. But they actually were just purchased by this company. Mm -hmm. So we were actually in the good. So we're gonna get some outlets. Or, I mean, what are those called? Breakers. Yeah. Crazy how expensive. Like, these right here are 50 bucks for these right here. I know. For like, I was like, that's crazy. So, we gotta do. I think these Don't are. Don't they have cheaper ones just. I'll look and see if I can find cheaper. Still have $18 by themselves. So, I think getting the box is cheaper for 40 Greg, climb. Who needs a worker? What do you got, Greg? <laughs> you know what? We'd have to, we'd have to like ring a bell and wait for six hours. And where's the bell? I'm just gonna it's like, nowhere. <laughs> I'm just gonna go climb. There you go. We got it. Three of these. 
We got the outdoor plug, it says. Yay, we, we found what we needed, a door. Mm -hmm. Yay. Hold on, babe, I'm coming with the cart. I haven't worked out since driveway. I know, you're, you're lapsing, let me see. Yay, we got a door. Who would have thought we lived here all these years without the right kind of door in the house? <laughs> all right, we need a we need door. It's already mitered. It's look cut. at that. We needed some door molding. So look at that. There's a whole set for forty dollars. Yay! All right, we were wrong. It's only for a single door, well, so we have to get no, two. You're right. It's, just, it's the it right is, thing. But we gotta it's get just two. For a single. They don't make it for the double door. Like, like I feel like they should have a leg right here, but they don't. Yeah. Or do they? Uh -uh. It's just the whole set. Yeah. All right, we need some door seal. Here we go. All right, we, we got a door again. seal. Look at us. So Yay. Yay, more stuff. Okay. One more thing. Okay. okay, some gloves. Don't throw them away. Don't. Well, the other ones were coated with cement. Oh, no, no, no. I'm just saying these ones. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if you really love me, you give me a pair of DeWalt's. I'll get you whatever you want. But I feel like these will get dirty and then we'll lose them. Yeah. Okay, I'm like exhausted and we haven't even done anything yet, babe. I know. <laughs> it's, I'm telling you, it's the weather. I'm like yawning. I'm like, I'm so tired right now. It's the weather. We haven't done it's anything. Dry. All right, we're going to go find a door handle. Okay, wives, when you're out here with your husband, download the Lowe's app, which I did not, and you know what? You can just type in everything you need, and it tells you which aisle everything is in. Your husband will love you that way. You will, you, as you're sitting here like going, okay, what else do we really need, so. You can just call out, hey baby. Aisle 19, bay 13, that's where we're heading right now. We gotta get some doorknobs. Acorn screws. <laughs> hey, we're back. Honey, tell him. He just smashed his head on the tell door. Tell him what happened to me. The door, the big giant door. <laughs> this pilot, you guys need a vehicle for working and carrying stuff? I mean, I recommend a truck, of Get course. a dually. <laughs> <laughs> no, I but a Honda Pilot, we'll do it. Look at we got a yeah. hot water heater, and we had got this Our fire door. door. And when I was trying to put it on the box, it like snagged on a... Um, Seatbelt. Seatbelt, yeah. And it just came, bam, right down top of my head. The guy next and I was to like you seeing like the Tweety, remember the old cartoons? Yeah. Did you see the little Tweety birds over my head? Just about that time, Amy turned around. She's like, great job, honey. The guy, good. The like, guy um, next to you offered to carry I can't carry see it. right now. <laughs> have some coffee, babe. We just, <laughs> Thanks. I'm like so tired. I'm like, we didn't even do anything yet. Yeah, I'm, I'm exhausted. I'm telling you, it's this cold, it's cold. gloomy it's so, it's, weather. It's literally 59 degrees today. I don't even know what happened. My pool is going crazy because it's so up and down with weather. I'm like, my goodness. Yeah. So, but I, our new I, pool. I left Florida. It was warm. 88 degrees, I think. I had my top down. Got so sunburned. Yeah. All the way about halfway through Georgia or something. So crazy. So yes, yeah, so we're, we're good. Okay, where are we going now? Are we going to Harbor Freight across the street or going to Home Depot, our real favorite store? Um, we had to get electrical stuff here. It was really expensive, so. Yeah, uh, I mean, it's probably going to be the same uh, price. They didn't have oh, yeah, the what stock or whatever. That's Most awesome. of it, but they were missing a few So you want to go across the street to Harbor Freight because we're right here? Yeah, whatever. It don't matter to me. We I just want order. a donut. Have a donut. <laughs> hey, goodness, for donuts. They had crispy, delicious I'm going to rub the donut on my bump. <laughs> and we're going to have a break. All right, we're looking at moving stuff here because here's my mover. Hey. <laughs> Look at this one. Do we want another one? We have one. Okay, we need to move some heavy, heavy. Okay, we're gonna get some of these. Two of these for the kids to ride on. They'll have fun oh, with that I before. It. Thinking for the chairs in the basement to be able to roll them out to the garage on that. Yeah. Definitely save your back. Yeah, and then we're thinking a hand, another hand truck, but we'll get that in just right. a minute. My back. Your back. All right, we're getting some of this, some Bondo, and mixing board. No fiberglass though. I found my tops over here. We gotta get a just get the six bucks. Six dollars, because you had like. I used to pay thirty dollars for those. Used to have like, I think I found two of these at home. I think I threw them away or what something. To them? I cleaning. I just wanted to make sure. I was cleaning and organizing. <laughs> or I don't know what happened to it. I don't know. Don't blame me. No idea. <laughs> oh, look at the green. That's like kind of a pretty color. Okay, we need tarps because we're gonna wrap our furniture, like our couches, in um, plastic. But I think that. Greg said it'd probably be better to do a tarp so we can lay stuff on top. Look at that heavy duty canvas. Oh, they have a oh, tarpage. Oh, yeah, like people are. Oh, look. People are covering their roofs after their roofs get ripped off after the hurricane, babe. <laughs> We're moving to hurricane so land, don't people. Get rid of this. <laughs> Keep this tarp. That's a new that's the new problem, hurricanes. <laughs> it's you, never know. you never go. Yeah, two tarps thinking like around the bedding around and the, couch. the couches because I don't want to ruin that. So I'm thinking that'll but be that was a very genius idea. What's that? About the bikes in a row. Yeah, and the cover. And stack in between the mics. Yeah. And then put a mattress on top here. That's what I'm thinking. Like that's what I'm wondering. Well, okay, we're gonna do this one for the bikes. We think so it'll get greasy stuff on this. No things. greasy on No greasy anything. On your okay, this, this is like what we do. Okay, Harbor Freight. Good job. Lots of good Thanks. things at Harbor Freight. So we saw they have a cordless or 
cordless? Yeah, string trimmer. Yeah, I was thinking, I didn't know what they were called. I'm always looking for a cordless weed whacker. Yeah, because you got the leaf blower. Right? Yeah, leaf blower and the electric lawnmower. Which works insanely which well. It's crazy, so we wanted to get the thing, and I'm like, I didn't even know they had them, but now they're called that a lawnmower string is like a power conservative kind of so thing weird. where it, it it's like measuring the resistance of the blade. And it knows when it gets in heavier grass to up the amps. That's so strange. That's so, pretty cool. I'm sure they all do that. And then, yeah. You know, this is just our first foray into the electric. That's so fun because we have a small little yard. Mm -hmm. <laughs> kind of nice. Yeah, so it'll be perfect. So we're gonna we're gonna go. I guess we're gonna go greener, greenish. Greenish by electric. Yeah. Is it technically greenish? You've got to plug it in. They got to use power. Yeah. Oh, our house is it, solar. It, yeah, the house is solar. Our house has solar panels. Yeah, on three sides of the roof. So pretty much everything runs off that, uh -huh. which is awesome. Yeah, it, fe it feeds into the grid. Yeah. So technically, we are greener. Yes. So it's good. Definitely. Our, fo our carbon footprint it's will be much smaller. smaller. And maybe rations out, evens out, because we have so many people. Uh huh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah. It's all good. Mm -hmm. So I mean, again, so we got good stuff in there. We were gonna get a dolly, but. I think I'm gonna call the moving company. And find I would. Out. I'm pretty sure they give you one. Cents, yeah, they so. got those nice ones for refrigerators and all that stuff. Some stuff. So that, and then we're gonna go to Home Depot now, favorite store. Yay! Yay. What do we need there? It's, uh, fiberglass and all the electrical. Okay. So we're almost done. It's yeah. like we've been out for a few hours, but we're getting everything. We'll be home, and everything will be there. Ready to work, work, work. All right, let's go to Home Depot. We'll we did it. We got everything we needed guys. right here in this vehicle. We got it. We did good. Now we're gonna go ahead home and. Uh, <coughs> oh, are we on? Yeah, we're on, baby. Hey, hey you're here. Okay, now we're gonna. This is an exciting time. And then, yeah. Is right seat position? <laughs> it's like we take a nap. We're gonna go ahead home. We're gonna start lots of. Yes, we're power. gonna go home. We're gonna get your chocolate chip cookies that you made for me. And we're gonna go sit and do that. And we're gonna go watch Moses for four hours. I know. I packed the DVD player. Uh, no recreation. No recreation. I took all possible. There's nothing to even sit on. I <laughs> the table's all painted and yeah, can't sit on what happened no this morning? Brooklyn had to pay Autumn money to <laughs> wear her black she's, and white vans. She's like, <laughs> I had my shoes are packed away. She's like, here, Autumn, she threw her a five dollar bill for yeah, her shoes. Well, it was cute because she she came out and she said that she picked up Autumn's shoes and Autumn was sleeping and she tapped her on the forehead and Autumn opened up one eye and Brooklyn held her shoes up and Autumn went. Nope. <laughs> Brooklyn had to go into her wallet, get some money. pull some money out Throw like this, and then Autumn was like, "Yeah, oh, okay." <laughs> so fun. So it's Teenagers. all good. Everything's packed away. So now we're gonna go head home, get all this fun stuff there. Yay! Yay! Right. We can actually start the work. It's gonna be good. Okay. The house is a little crazy. It's such a mess, but we're getting there. So we are back. We're doing. A lot of projects. I'm not filming all the projects right now because it is late in the day, but I'm gonna get dinner rolling because it is dinner time. So this is what I'm gonna do for dinner tonight. I'm gonna do our big boy burgers. These big ones, I'm excited because look at the sauce. I have that right here, secret sauce. So we're gonna have that. I'm gonna put these in the smoker. And then I'd, I didn't have like fries or something. I do have a little bit of tater tots, but I'm gonna save those for tater tot casserole. I have these, so I'm gonna cook these in the air fryer and we can have, you know, like a gigantic tater tot with the burgers. It's going to work. And I got bacon, we got lettuce and cheese. And I feel like that's going to be a good, good burger right there. So I have these in here, staying warm. And then I put out buns. We've got our special sauce. I got pickles. This, I got to get cheese out and stuff too. Let me get that out. And then we got, good. We got cheese, lettuce, and bacon right here. Looking good. I'm going to go out and let's check the burgers. Nighttime out here. It's a little chilly. It's like 59 degrees. Pretty chilly for Memorial Day weekend. Burgers looking good. These look really good. The big boy burgers. Can you turn them? Oh, yeah, look at that. I don't remember what the price was, but these are good, hearty burgers. All right, here is dinner burgers. We got lettuce, we got cheese, all the good toppings, pickles, bacon, and our big, giant, gigantic tater tots. All right, I'm coming down the end of the hallway here because we got a lot going on, lots of people, lots of talking. So it's been a busy day. So we've had a great day starting our projects, getting them done. I'm going to film more tomorrow, bring you along. It's good. So thank you for watching. Told you it's our journey. This is what we're doing today. It was a shopping day, picking up a lot of supplies, but we did it. So thank you for watching. Come back tomorrow. We'll do more. I promise. All right. See you tomorrow. Bye.